So today we've got an exhibition of, of sonic arts, a range of projects from students across the spectrum of our, our program. And I guess it's really worth explaining what sonic arts is. It's the creative use of music technology. So using music technology as a medium for creativity rather than as a more conventional tool for making music or uh, film soundtracks or whatever. Today I had a chance of putting together a project that explores motion. Through computer vision and a camera, the computer gets data from what people are doing in front of it and translate that into audio and hopefully music. So it was really, really exciting to see them try to figure it out, to play around with it and to react to the sounds and the visuals that were happening. This is a binaural recording head that I've been working on for the past couple months. Uh, essentially it just records uh, the same way that humans hear, um, so it spatializes sound. It's just very interesting to see how people interact with, with it and how, how they took it in. It's quite interesting that people can uh, understand the same thing in very different ways. When projects come alive is at this kind of a moment. It's one thing to be a creative person uh, away in your studio space, feeling excited about what you're doing, but really the proof is in the interaction with an audience. So that's what's made today very special, is seeing people put on a set of reversed binaural headphones and, and be very confused by what they're hearing and engaging with listening, you know. Um, so yeah, just the inventiveness of it, um, you can see that drawing people in, drawing people into the technology, to the interactions, and just to sound itself.